Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So over two years ago on the channel, I posted a video showing you how you can check out useful information about your RAM and hard drive. Now for what it's worth, that video will be linked down below and in the end screen. And my reason for mentioning that previous video is because it ties into what we're going to talk about today. Now, in that video, we kind of had an overview of information about your RAM. So in today's video, I thought just to show you how you can check out all your RAM and memory details that's installed um, in your Windows PC. So basically, you can check out the most useful information about the RAM that's installed and all the available details at the same time, it kind of collated all into one place. So how we do this is we need to run command prompt. So if you don't know where that is, you just hit your search and enter CMD. And we need to run command prompt as administrator, else that will, and this will not work. Now at the prompt, what we need to do is we need to enter this command. Now, as always, this will be down below in the description for you to copy and paste for easy access and reference. So at the prompt, we right click and then we hit enter and there we go. And here's a full list and all the memory details about my RAM. Now, yeah, you can see just a brief breakdown. We've got one bank and two banks. So I'm just going to focus here to give you a general idea. And just to focus on some key highlights, yeah, we've got the capacity, the data width. It's located in slot one on the left, which is, you know, gives you some precise information. Uh, what else can we check out here? The manufacturer is Samsung. You've got the part number. You've got the serial number. You've got the speed. So you get the idea. And the same applies to the other bank. So this can be quite useful if you are, as an example, wanting to um, replace your RAM. Maybe it's damaged. Or if you want to upgrade your RAM. So you get the idea. And I think this is quite useful. So... Um, in conjunction with that previous video and what we've spoken about today, I think you'll have a complete overview of um, the details of the memory and the RAM that is installed on your Windows device. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.